terror directed against the Jewish people of New York and all over the country. But in New York, Jews are being beaten up in Brooklyn, in Manhattan. Jewish blood is running in the streets of New York. People being intimidated, people being assaulted, people ending up in the hospital by, by those who are filled with venom and hate. It's called anti-Semitism, clearly. And where is the political leadership? Where is, where is the progressive leaders that stand up for human rights and civil rights? But that doesn't include the Jewish people. Jews are not part of that. Mayor de Blasio, missing in action, intimidated, acting cowardly, not doing the right thing. And, and where, where's the tough guy? Where is the tough guy? Governor Cuomo, you can't find him either. Where's he hiding? Under what rock is he hiding? Why isn't he speaking out? And of course, you have the great senator, the powerful senator from New York, the protector of the Jewish people, what he has told us for the past 25 years. He's not protecting anybody except himself. He's so terrified of AOC running against him that he is betraying the fundamental values, betraying his people. Jewish blood in the streets of New York, and they are silent in Jerry Nadler. You, you don't hear from Jerry Nadler. Where is he? Can anyone find? We got to get flashlights and we got to look for the Blasio and Cuomo and we got to look for Schumer. And we got to look for Nadler because they are cowards. The double standard when it comes to the Jewish people is unbelievable. I spoke to uh, the father of a young man, Joey, who was beaten senseless in the streets of New York. Senseless. Ends up in the hospital, Bellevue Hospital. The father says, what in God's name is going on? Where is the political leadership? These attacks are happening constantly. Many of them are not being reported. And our political leadership is missing in action. They are simply cowards. Cowards is what they are.